What's up guys, it's Blooming Guy, and welcome back to Paper Mario. In the last part, we were doing Peach and Bowser little segments. Those are really time-consuming. It's okay, because we're back on track. Hey, look, the thing from Super Mario World. Ah, technology. Look at Mario trying to street pass. <laughs> That's the new mailbox at the P, isn't it? Wow, neat. Did you get the mail? Uh, spam... Bills. Uh, some Viagra. Uh, never mind. Uh, okay. Uh, my dearest Mario, I send this letter in hope that it reaches you safely. I am being held against my will in some strange place. Though I do not know where I am, I remain unharmed and relative in comfort. Those who have captured me seem to be after the map I sent you earlier. They may be hoping it to use f objects they find crystal stars. I do not know what they are planning, but I have a feeling that it's not anything positive. Mario, please collect these crystal stars before they do. You must. They are already aware. You have a map, so please be very careful. And please don't worry about me, Princess Peach. Wow, you got mail from a princess. That's so cool. So anyway, she's unhurt. That's good, at least. Mm-hmm. But I didn't like the sound of those kidnappers looking for the crystal stars as well. Yeah, well, we'll just deal with it. I'm not going to attempt to fight anybody, I hope. <laughs> Because it's so time-consuming. That's why, I think that's why I wanted to make a Danger Mario. Time-consuming fights. I know it's an RPG and stuff, and RPG rules, you're supposed to fight, like, turn-based and stuff, but come on. It'd be so much easier if I just go up and one-shot them and move on. Like in, you know, in the real Mario, when you jump on a Goomba's head, they just die. All right. Let's see. Another thing's gonna, yep, I knew it. If I, if I had jumped, I would have been messed up. Too bad I can't swim, because every water has, like, a giant fish that Mario could probably beat. Or I would think he could beat. Don't land on him. Now we have to go, I think, to the... Yeah, we just have to go to a lower chamber. Perfect. Actually, first, let me show you a quick way. Like, remember in the previous episodes when I said, oh yeah, there's a golden fuzzy here and all that other stuff? Well... There's a way to get the information, so you don't have to worry about, oh, perfection, or like 100%ing, or all that other stuff. See right here, this is Frankly's place, and you see right here in the garbage, there's a little page right here. You found a scrap piece of paper in the garbage with info about the gold fuzzy. It has been transferred to your title log. And if I look again, you found a scrap piece of paper in the garbage with info about Hooktail. It has been transferred to your title log. Now that it's gone... Well, I'm guessing Professor Frankly was like, yeah, he's looking up Hooktail, and he's not going to bother to email us the weaknesses or anything like that. So, you know, you just go there to the golden bin, and then you find out the information, and then we go to our title log over here. Title log. And if we go... Right, here's the gold fuzzy, right? And down here they tell you about it. And then Hooktail should be, like, right here, at the bottom. Hooktail. Did it have 20 HP? Yeah, I was right. It does have 20 HP. And if you do a cricket thing, it'll weaken its attack. Oh, well, the good. All right, now back to the Crystal Star stuff. Okay. All right. I mean, but the regular enemies, you're still gonna have to find the tattles for. So, that's the only downside. I think we can do this. Wait, can I? Yep, I can. Just real quick. Then you gotta waste time. That is what I love. Still the spin does. But I still have to... Mm. Can I get... Nope, no cross-ups. Good. Let's keep going. Nope. Alright. Nice and quick. Just how I like it. Here's the place. Oh yeah, I think there's like a... Let's just have this power now. I think you can just glide to the other side. Yep. There we go. And I think over here is the pit of a hundred trials, which I will do eventually. It's just extremely tedious and boring. and I might like do little halves of it, There's, like, some trouble quest eventually that I'll get that'll make me do it. But it's alright. I can, I can definitely... I'm down with it. It's good. 
I might just do it just to get the little one of the items that are really helpful later on in the game. And then maybe I'll just continue the rest of them when I think I'm ready. Um, all right, Mario. Hold up that crystal star. Here we go. Holding it up. This mystical panel. And there's one of them. Looks really nice. And now, little map effect. Wow, it's floating. This dirty old piece of paper is levitating. That's nice. And then, let's see where the next location is. But I already know it, but, you know, for you guys. I like how the map updates also. Like, the Hooktails Castle wasn't there before, now it is. Oh, one of my least favorite locations in the game. Boogly tree in the boogly woods. <sighs> it's fine. And then the beautiful little screen tear effect. I love that. It's awesome. If they remade Paper Mario for the Wii U, I wish that like the the graphics would get better, like just progressively. Like it just looks more and more beautiful when that would happen. Anyway, the location of the Crystal Star has been added and recorded on your magical map. Hmm, this dirty old piece of paper. Hmm, with nothing on it. Hey, uh, Mario, look there. The next crystal star showed up on the map. But, I'm sorry, I don't have a clue where that is. Oh, we could just ask the professor. Um, I think maybe we should take it to Professor Frankly and let him look at it. Yeah. Meanwhile, back at the sewers, getting out of the sewers off screen to Professor Frankly's place. Hmm. 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 I see, I see. Crystal clear. Um, so can you tell us where the next crystal star is or not? It's in Boggly Woods. The second crystal star is inside a great tree there. A great tree in Boggly Woods, huh? About those woods, I think some odd creatures live there that look like this thing that looks like squished up silly putty that's gray. If memory serves, there's a pipe beneath town that leads to those woods. Um, Professor Frankly, you should probably know it's about Princess Peach. Mr. Mario got an email from her recently. Her Highness said that the guys who kidnapped her are also hunting for the Crystal Stars. Oh, and she said she doesn't even know where she's being held, so, yeah. Uh-oh, Princess Peach's kidnappers are also looking for the Crystal Stars. What could they hope to achieve? Could the treasure be... Ah, too many unknowns. Unfortunately, the only clues we can rely on are the Crystal Stars in that map. Mm-hmm. Well, my guess all we can do is head to Bugly Woods to find that next Crystal Star. Yes, I recommend you do that. And find it before the princess's captors do. But don't be hasty. If you're low on items or health, drop by the shop and in first. I'll keep researching to learn more about the crystal stars and ancient treasure. So what we're going to do with the remaining time we have, before I breach off into the side quests, we're going to see Merlin. Welcome to the home of Merlin, a super magician. I foresaw your arrival. I can aid you with your wish, if you wish. With three shine sprites, I have the power. I can power up your partners. Of course, that means I boost their attack, but I also throw in a new move for free. So which partner would you like me to power up? I only have four so far, and it costs three, so for now, Goombella. Shall I power up this partner? Yeah, go ahead. Go nuts. Shazibi! Shazubi! Oh! I need to find two more Shine Sprites if we want to power up Coops, and I think I can find them. I think I know where they are. Yay! Then you may go! So Goomba's health went up, and I think a couple other things changed. Her health went up, her head bonk does two damage now, which is great. Uh, oh, sorry. Uh, she has multi bonk now, which is, you know, multi bounce pretty much. And that's about it. Great. So in order to find these next two, the next two shine sprites we need, one of them I can tell it's easy access. It's over here. And I think, oh yeah, we have to get those. Oh yeah, it's not here. So though that's that's a different thing. Oh, I found a star piece though. That works. And the star piece up there. Yeah, we're gonna be doing a little side quest. Not not side questing, but you know, a little fooling around. I like I like the fact that they give you options here. Okay, so what I'll do is 
There should be a shine sprite somewhere. Should be. Oh, yeah. This. Hey, valued customer. Your contact lens is in. Please drop by our shop. Okay. Well, thank goodness I did that beforehand. Otherwise, it would have been, been a while. I'm going to need 10 coins for that contact lens. Want to buy it, fella? Sure. Thanks, fella. I can give it to that mean old lady who was mean. Did you bring me my contact lens, Mr. Squishy? There. A contact lens? Oh, sweet relief. Thank you. Finally, the world is crisp and clear again. I can see. Oh, I'm so happy. Be careful from now on. People don't generally like having their stuff stomped on. She always looks mad to me. I don't know if it's because of the screen or what, but let's talk to this guy. Hey, hey, oh, I got all the new artist products right here. Look no further. You want, you've got the fevered look of a man from Michael Goods. Want to buy something? No, thank you. Nothing here is good. He's basically like a, like a Rolf, the badge owner. But he'll, t he'll, t he'll give you some badges, but to me right now, nothing's really worth it. So now we're in the other part of town since we gave her a contact lens. And we need to find, I think, two more Shine Sprites. So, I don't have him yet. So what we can do is we can go in here. We're not supposed to go in here. We can go in here. I think we can be able to find at least one. Yep. We can find at least something. Here we are. And I think over here, there's, this guy will teach you... I think one of the people, if you talk to them, they'll teach you how to do little stylish commands. But I already know how to do them, so... It's not really... Not really much. Soft Stomp, which is always good, weakens the attack of the person, I think. Come on, just... If I had the bomb, um, guy... Something back here? No, nothing. So, why did I... Oh, I think I know. Yeah, I see it. Dazzles, she's on the other side, so I have to trade that later. I need shine sprites. Man. Need shine sprites. I think if I go let's check down here. I know we're not supposed to be here, but eh. Exploration is key. I don't think anything here is for I don't think anything's here. Right now. So eh, forget it. I'll just go back up. I think. <laughs> Um, yeah, I don't think anything's here, really, so we have to wait it out. I <sighs> thought we could really power up coops. But at least we have access to this side of town now. Because of the thing we did. So, that's, that's, uh, that's something. Now, there is another little side quest here. Well... We're going to do Trouble Center um, in the next few parts. But I'm going to have them separate from the overall story, so... For now, let's just... Let's talk to this, this green rat right here. Hey, you're Mario. Yeah. Wow, this is so cool. I never thought I'd meet a celebrity out here. Ooh, I know. Do you want to make an investment, Mario? What do you mean? My name's Lumpy, and I'm heading out to Dry Dry Desert to prospect for oil. Dry Dry Desert was in the previous game, so it's a good reference. I live my life hoping to get rich quick, and now my chance has come. But I still don't have enough startup funds. Could you please lend me some money? Hmm. How much? Uh... Yeah, let's lend you some cash. It's alright. Thank you so much. You won't regret it. Okay, so it says if we talk to him, right? Ah, Mario, you come again. My dream is to get rich. Yeah. Yeah. So I gave him some money, and I think he would give us more. So we'll get the we'll get that money, I think, eventually. But I don't know when. When he'll come back. In the meantime, we can. Oh yeah, we we just invested. So yeah, I'll just uh, just I'm gonna sit here, and uh, I'll save for now. Uh, the next few episodes will probably be little tr side trouble quests, some help, some anything you need. We're going to do side quests in the next part, so we can progress with the story a little bit later. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys later.